In this video, I want to show you how to install Anaconda Python distribution in which we can create uh, Python data science projects and Gurobi optimization software that can be used from Python to solve linear and mixed integer optimization problems. Okay, the first step is to go to the website anaconda.com and download and install the Anaconda Python distribution. Once the uh, website opens, we need to click free download here on the right top and then click download here in the middle and the download will begin because the file is quite large. I'm going to pause the recording here until the download is finished. Once the download is finished, we can uh, click on the downloaded file and begin the installation. Uh, we click next, agree to the license agreement, uh, keep the selection to install just as a user, not as administrator, and then keep the default directory, press next. Uh, here among those four options, I recommend in addition to first and third checkbox, you select also the second checkbox to add Anaconda to the uh, path environment variable, which uh, will allow us to use just a regular command prompt rather than uh, anaconda prompt to run all the anaconda commands. And then we click install. Uh, the installation is also quite long, so I'm going to pause the recording here until it is finished. Once the installation is finished, we click next, uh, next again and then we can uncheck the two boxes to launch Anaconda Navigator or getting started window and we can click finished and uh, finish and then we we are we have installed Anaconda Python distribution. The second step is to go to gurobi.com website and download and install Gurobi Optimizer. When you go to the website uh, for the first time uh, you first need to create an account with Gurobi uh, to do this, you have to click register and follow all the steps. If you have a, a university email account and you want academic license, then uh, you, you should use your university email um, and follow all the steps. Uh, I already have uh, an account, so I will click login, provide my uh, university login and password. Uh, password, of course, is for the Gurobi account and then uh, uh, I will have access to the user portal where you can uh, download the software and also uh, obtain Gurobi uh, licenses. To obtain uh, Gurobi software, we need to go to uh, Downloads, which is here on the right top, and then click Gurobi software. This is going to open another um, browser window, and here we will have a list of versions of Gurobi optimization software, uh, which is for different uh, computers, Windows, Linux, uh, Apple computers, and others. I will select the first one for Windows, and this is going to start the download. I will pause for a moment here. Once the download is finished, we can click on the downloaded file to begin the installation. Um, then click Next, uh, accept the license agreement, click next, uh, leave the default uh, folder Gurobi, uh, for Gurobi installation, click next, then click install, uh, and then wait for Gurobi to finish the installation. I will again pause the installation here for a moment to save time. Once the installation is finished, we click finish, and uh, you may want to restart the computer at this point and that uh, finishes the installation of Gurobi. The third step is to obtain a Gurobi license. To do this, we again have to go to the Gurobi uh, user portal. And in the portal here on the left, we have to click Licenses and then click Request. Uh, there are two types of licenses one can request. They are either academic, if you have uh, a university email address as a student or faculty member, or commercial. Uh, the commercial one, if you want to try for commercial purposes, you can request an evaluation license for 30 days. Uh, if you are a uh, student or faculty, you can request uh, a license that is valid for one year and it's only for academic purposes. 
to generate a license, uh, we need to uh, scroll down here and click Generate Now, uh, and then fill out all the information and get approval from Gurobi. Uh, once uh, the license is approved, we go back here to the user portal, click Licenses, and then again Licenses, and then the list of approved licenses will appear. As you can see, I have here three uh, academic licenses that I requested previously. Actually, all of them are installed, so I cannot show you the installation process in detail. However, the installation is quite simple. You click this button install and it tells you uh, what command line you need to run on your computer. And basically you copy that command line, go to menu start, type cmd, open command prompt and paste that command, which actually will start with grb get key and it will be followed by some long code. Once you paste this command and press enter, the license should be installed. Uh, if uh, you obtain an error when you're installing uh, the Gurobi license, you need to contact Gurobi support to uh, solve the problem. Uh, usually the error message in the command prompt uh, explains how to, what kind of error and how to contact support in order to uh, get help. The next step is to test if Gurobi and uh, the Gurobi license work. Uh, to do this, we need to uh, open command prompt by going to menu start, typing cmd and enter, and then typing command Gurobi. And if you get an error here and you return to the Windows prompt, then that means something is wrong with Gurobi or the Gurobi license. Uh, uh, if you get this Gurobi greater prompt, that means Gurobi is working and the license is also working. We can type exit, open close parenthesis, and then exit to close the, the window. Uh, next, we have to link Gurobi to Anaconda so that later on within Jupyter Notebooks uh, in Python, we can actually use Gurobi library uh, for optimization. To do this, we need to open command prompt or anaconda prompt and la run the following two uh, conda uh, commands. Uh, as you can see, conda config add channel and then conda install gurobi. So to do this, I will again open menu start, uh, type cmd to run the command prompt. And here I'm going to copy and paste conda config add channels line. Uh, this usually results in a warning that the channel is already there, so we don't we didn't really need to run this line. And then conda uh, install Gurobi. Uh, I will type this line, um, and this is going to install the Gurobi library within uh, Anaconda. This usually takes time, so I'm going to uh, pause the recording here for a moment until we get the next prompt. Now we see information that. Uh, uh, Gurobi package will be installed and then one more package will be updated. We get a prompt to proceed. We press enter to proceed. And the installation or downloading uh, uh, begins. And again, I will pause the recording to save time. After a little bit of time, the downloads are finished and then installation is completed. We can close the command prompt window. The final step is to test if the installation of Anaconda and Gurobi with the license works correctly. Uh, so to do this, again, we need to open command prompt or Anaconda prompt, and then we need to start Jupyter Notebook or a more advanced version Jupyter Lab, and then run these commands where we import Gurobi library and then try an empty uh, Gurobi model, optimization model. We try to create a model and optimize it and see if this uh, does not result with any errors. If we get errors, that means something is wrong. If we have no errors, but some uh, output uh, of the Gurobi log, then that means everything is correct. So I'm going to again open menu start, cmd, enter, and then type here Jupyter Lab to open uh, the advanced version of the Jupyter Notebook. This is, should open uh, a browser window, and in that window we will see uh, we will be able to create a new uh, Jupyter Notebook, Python 3. Here we need to, we can copy paste the lines, or I will type them from Gurobi Pi import 
var, and then I will run this. If there is no error, I run this by pressing Control Enter or clicking play here. Since there is no error, that means the library is visible, it's available in Anaconda, and then I can try to create an empty model by saying model equals capital model. Right? The, the capitalization is important, and then model dot optimize. Uh, so that's creating an empty model with no variables, no constraints, no objective, and then running the optimization. And since I'm not getting any errors, that means Gurobi is working and it's available in my Jupyter notebook in, in from Python. So uh, so that means we are now ready to use uh, Python with Jupyter notebook uh, from Jupyter notebook and uh, create different optimization models, linear, mixed integer, and use Gurobi to solve them.